Welcome back to the second episode of uh, Sid Meier's Sim Golf on Impossible Difficulty. And, uh, well, let's just get to it. We have Ivana Richman on the course today. Let's have a little bit of a look at her. Oh, we got Olga as a new member. That's nice. We got six basic members right now, plus ten visitors. So Ivana Richman. Listen to those birds singing. Now I'll hit it straight. After uh, doing a little bit of a ball washing. And if she wants a rich man, she's probably going to have to do a lot of ball washing, I'm assuming. Alright, so th this hole doesn't really play super fast. JP, that's not big though, miss it? It is, but he's not here in a, like, to pay me if he likes the course uh, capacity. He's just out of play. So I guess he likes the course. Okay, Ivana. Show us what you got. Oh, that wasn't Ivana. That was Florence. Oh, Ivana already teed off. I guess that's so ball or something now. Oh, yeah, so Randy Rager, as you can see here, he just sold some... Um, uh, some soft drink to someone. As, uh, he kind of doubles as also your, like your character, but also he can be like any kind of, um, um, any kind of employee. Sorry, I, I struggle to find the word there. But uh, Ivan Richman is uh, fairly happy. And, uh, Good thanks for noticing. Loves walking over scenic bridge. Cram in a few of those, honestly. It'll uh, it'll really increase the happiness of your uh, golfers. It's a bit of waiting over here. Um, I wonder if I should get an employee that speeds up play. People will be unhappy if they have to wait for too long. Then they just start patrolling, trying to find someone to make happy or sell something to. Just quite the, quite the people please on this guy. Now our goal for this episode is basically to get our uh, finances sorted. And in order to do so, it is just a matter of time. I want to see what Ivana Richman uh, does when she plays her, and then I want to hopefully get a donation from her and then place that out. And then I want to try another round on the course, see if I can... Uh, Play a bit better with the uh, skill improvements that we got last time around. Generally, people are liking this. As you can see, having a greeter, Dennis and Solomon were in the yellow. Now they're in like slightly green after Randy Rager said hello to them. And they're getting happier and happier. They're liking the sundial over here that's putting them in a good mood when they start. It is important to keep your golfers happy on impossible difficulty. Uh, but the true challenge doesn't really happen until you have maybe three or four holes. Then it's going to be a little bit more of a problem. And as I've said, if you... The, the way the game works, I think that's Ivana's ball right there. Uh, that one. No, that's Florence. That might be Ivana's. Yes. All right, she landed uh, better than Florence, so that's good. She's very happy, so I think she's going to donate for, uh, to us. Walk over the scenic bridge, they get more happy. I should probably just like put water <laughs> after holes and such. Oh, JP is under the tree. Well, I mean, you can't hate on me for you being bad. You know, don't hate on my course <laughs> for you sucking, please. Uh, but yeah, um, when we kind of progress a little bit, uh, the thing is, for these things to trigger happiness, and I'm not sure if it's like that in every difficulty. I never really had an issue with this in any other difficulty than impossible. Uh, like, these things need to be on screen to actually have the effect that they have. If they're not on screen, they just won't have the effect, unfortunately. Um, so, yeah, that might be an impossible only thing. I'm not sure. So... What you want to do to keep golfers happy at all times is you want to play like this. But what I don't want to do is play like this. However, now all the trees are fading out, so I, I need to stand corrected her a little bit. We have two scenic trees, not several. These are just lonely trees, not scenic ones. 
we're keeping people happy-ish, and uh, if Ivan Richman gives us the right thing, like, you kind of, on impossible difficulty, you kind of want to prop your entire course full of shit that makes people happy. And I'll, I'll show you the issues that can arise once they start rising, I think. Uh, Ivan Richman's very happy. She's having a good time. Wow, our skill rating has dropped. It was on like 2, now it's 0, 74. What the hell happened? So there's no skill rating on their soul anymore. Uh, you know what, actually I'm gonna... Okay, so people are gonna go out of bounds, it's just how it is. Someone went out of bounds there, so... I think after removing that tree, uh, that was like there, this, this course is just too easy. So we're gonna put that tree back in. And we're just gonna have a little bit of a train thing here. And Ivana... Wait a minute. Did she not just finish? She's not playing anymore. Did we get the landmark? Oh, we did. She, she donated a Stonehenge. Happy endings. And uh, we get one for free. So... I'd say we place it... No, oh, you know what we do? We actually uh, kind of place it over this... Uh... Let's put it like this. Oh, he's gonna he's gonna fuck up now. Oh, no, he isn't. We put a Stonehenge there, right? Happy endings, and it also creates a little bit of challenge for people that you need to kind of play around with. Maybe we add more fairway on the side here later, but for now it's it's okay. I wonder if we should hire a uh, club pro to greet people. It's three hundred per week, which is a bit expensive. Not oh, so I had to cough though. Um. I don't know, like, right now, we need to get our finances in order. So I think maybe... Maybe we don't get more employees right now. But as soon as these guys have teed off her, I want to do a practice round. If you play when they're on the tee... Uh, if you start practice round when they're on the tee, then you will kind of delete them from the course. And you won't get the money from them. Yeah, so, okay, this is a bit, the, 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 yeah, I mean, this is skill rating, uh, like, over one, at least. Just this hole is dragging down right now due to it being quite easy on, like, the final approach here. Or it was. Now it's harder now that we have that Stonehenge in place. Okay, they've left the uh, tee. Uh, once I actually managed to uh, delete my main character and I couldn't get him back, what I did was I went for him to tee off, then I was like, no, I'm deleting the tee, I believe it was. And then um, as a result of that, he got deleted as well, and I just didn't have a main character anymore. So there are some bugs with this game, for sure. It's nothing too bad. Okay, well, uh, Jimmy was almost hit by a shot from another hole. Was he? Where is Jimmy? Okay, yeah, so it's a little bit of issue with the people coming back and forth here, but... It isn't enough to break their happiness fully, so... We can do it this way, it's fine. Like, they're, they're happy enough in this area that it isn't an issue. But yeah, where do we land? It's, which one of these balls are mine? I'm assuming this one? Because that other guy was pretty happy with a shot, I didn't really watch it. I mean, we're making good money. People are liking the course. I think we're just gonna go low here and hope for the best. Could have been better, not gonna lie. So there's a few people that have used four... Well, okay. Eleven people have used four stalks to get in the hole here. Yeah, so by the end of next year, we should be clear in the economical department. If we're not, we can sell off some things that we purchased just to uh, meet our deadline. We got bogey, Bob got par. It's only practice round, so it's not really a big deal. 
Okay. Well, I think we just go for long and straight down there. That should work out. And we're off, we're out of bounds. Well, thank fuck it's a uh, practice round. Down in the out of bounds. And Ray just disappointed that an easy looking shot ended up in the out of bounds. If it happens again, he will become discouraged. Well, that's okay. Just hit better. Straight though. Oh. Yeah, a little bit of a curiosity is required here due to the out of bounds nature. Oh, very nice. Randy Ranger, uh, Randy Ranger launches a tricky drive 202 yards safely onto the fairway to hole 2. Bob looks on in amazement. Randy Ranger's power hitter skill improves 30%. Very nice. March, Ivana donates a rock face. August, Ivana donates a Stonehenge. The board is very worried about your lingering death. We've cut it about in half since last year, so... You have one more year to get out of depth. So if we get into October this year and we still have depth, then uh, we're gonna need to sell some things just to cover our asses. Because if you're in depth two years in a row, it's game over. So we can't have that. But I think we should do okay. I mean, people are using the putting green, I assume. Can we check like a financial report somewhere? I've never really looked into that. I think there's a financial report somewhere. Uh, but I'm not sure where. Yeah, I just don't. Maybe it's this. Core support. Da, 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 da. Financial report. So what gives us money here? We made a lot on food and drinks. Um... Wait, what, what's the actual income here? Oh, green fees, right. So, if it's like last year, maintenance, interest, I don't know what the hell this. Salaries is quite a bit, but okay. I mean, I, f I feel like we should be able to get in the green uh, by the end of this year. And if we don't, we can always just reset the rough here and get the money back f that we've spent on uh, the various scenery. Oh, let's see. Them having to go back here around all this way uh, kind of slows down play a little bit, which isn't ideal, but there's only so much I can do about it. I think we're going to have to play, uh, do a little bit of a setup stroke here. Shot looks pretty easy. Uh, okay, so maybe we need to make it perceived as more difficult in this area. I'm wondering how do I do that, and I can't do too much right now except for change train elevations since we don't have the money for it, but maybe some more bunkers or something, I really don't know. And oh, yeah, they're trying to, they try to bounce off the slope there, but what we're gonna do is use my favorite stroke in the game, which is the uh, well, this one. Is Randy Rage in a bad mood? I mean, someone's being unhappy here. We can't really see where that landed unless we rotate. Uh, that's a possible putt to make, so we could get par on this. No, we could not get par this, on this because we had an out of bounds, and that adds a penalty stroke, and then you need... To, like, you had a stroke, and then it's penalty stroke, and then you, like... If you, if you go out of bounds on your first stroke, you have to hit again. You can drop your ball somewhere on the course in real life. But basically, in this game at least, you start back on, um, on the tee again and it will be your third stroke. Same happens if you smack in the water, it's, it's a penalty stroke. As if hitting the water itself isn't penalty enough to begin with. Uh, but yeah, we're just going to leave Randy Rager here so he can say hello to people, sell them drinks and whatnot. I mean, people are generally not so happy from him not being there. So yeah, I mean, you, you got all these, like, you got fun, attitude, energy, hunger, thirst. You need to keep these things, uh, you know, in, in a positive light. 
the skill rating on this hole is up a little bit, but it is still actually in the somewhat negative. But it's just we need a larger sample size to play through it, and we need to make some changes to just kind of make this hole perceived as more difficult. And there are many ways we can do that, but uh, we need a little bit of money. I'm starting to get some ideas of what we can do in like this section here that could make the hole better. Unfortunately right now there isn't too much more to do than just kind of wait. Uh, I do want Randy Rager to hang around here. So he greets people and, and that makes them happy, he sells some drinks, which also makes them happy, covers a thirst. I just have to see how things can pan out. We got another member. Mary applies to membership. Paul, best course he's, he or she has ever played. I'm assuming he. Well, I guess I shouldn't be assuming people's gender in the year 2021. Shit, it's 2022 in like two days. As of recording this video, anyway. And I'm just wondering a little bit about this river here. I'm thinking we could just race the terrain across the board here. Like this. Oops, not like that. And there we go. I think that's slightly better. Well, I mean, people are enjoying themselves, but there is quite a bit of a queue piling up here. And it is simply because they have to go all the way around here to get back to the course. Tired of waiting for these bosos. Yeah, there we go, that is an issue. You need to kind of deal with these things as they arise. Uh, what I'm going to do is I'm actually going to hire an employee to speed up play here. It's a ranger, 200 per week. It's a bit expensive and I really don't have the money to spare right now but there's quite a pile left over here so we need to hurry things up in this area. Florence applies for membership so we got um, 10 members I mean instead of just kind of building 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 and just expanding there's gonna be an issue most of the times there's, there's gonna be something that you want to improve on so that the whole course just works better so just build a hole see how it plays you know, and then kind of make adjustments as you see fit based on feedback from uh, uh, from your uh, patrons. Wait, I mean, well, we should be good uh, and ready in positive economical state by the end of this year, I would say. And if we could also have a little bit more uh, skill rating on this hole sometime soon it would be good so we're definitely gonna have to make some changes in this area I have a feeling that maybe we can expand the course like we could remove this path and expand a little bit fairway here put bunkers in here more fairway over here and then a green expansion over here with some challenges like we could have the lower point here could for instance be a pot bunker as well that would be perceived as quite challenging i believe but these aren't masterfully created holes these are just to get going type holes and uh, once we start getting a little bit of money we can definitely create something um, a little bit more intricate and um kind of what the um algorithm so to say of the game was but we have 11 members so i mean more members than visitors right now so people are enjoying the golf course so far anyway although you are hearing a lot of complaining going on here but uh yeah 
I'm not so sure this guy's actually speeding up a damn thing. Come on, come on. Take a megaphone and, and disturb all these golfers over here. Make them play. Uh, they're not using the benches. They're just standing around. Which I think that drains their energy a little bit. But also so high on energy here already that maybe... Do you see how that changed? They walked over the bridge. Attitude up 50%. Fun up a bit. So a few of these bridges around your course can really save your ass. People just really like scenic bridges. And we are in the green. So I think we just go for the rest of this year here. So we're absolutely 100% in the green by the end of it. There's two months left after August. Uh, as the uh, season ends after October. And then starts up again. Uh, in March maybe? I'm, I'm not 100% sure. But as I said in the previous episode, you don't have full uh, 12 month years in this game. Maybe you do on like tropical tile sets or desert tile sets because they're not going to be as effective. Well, I mean, it's not going to be winter, though, but it's probably going to be hotter seasons, which might be the off season there. I don't know. Not 100% sure how that works. Alright, so we're kind of like lingering in and out of being out of uh, financial trouble here. Huh? And, uh, yeah. Now, there's many ways you can build courses in this, uh, in this game. You don't need to do it like I do at all. I just like to kind of have the, the various holes kind of look like a golf hole would look in, you know, in reality. But, I mean, they're paying good. Plus a thousand, plus nine hundred. I think a thousand is pretty much the highest you can go right now until you make some upgrades. And, uh, yeah, like, just... Having stuff here that keeps them happy. Just have, like, this bridge, getting them over this bridge, Randy Rager saying hello to them, all these things. And they can buy a drink if they want, also. All these things kind of add up. And, uh, yeah, it just kind of starts your golfers off paying more straight off the bat. Or straight off the club, I guess I should say, in this, uh, in this context. But yeah, we're in the positives, and uh, life is good. So, yeah. Okay, they are using... I was afraid they weren't using this putting green, but they are. Which gives us 400 simoleons. Um, per use. So, so it's good. And it also improves their putting skill, which makes them play better and faster. So it's just very positive in, in every way. This, this whole whole two here, it really needs a rework. Um, so I think that's going to be a focus before we expand further. We're going to do some magic with this whole here. Just want to make sure that we get to the end of this year. And that we are in a good financial state by that time. So it, I, I, I realize this isn't necessarily super interesting or anything. Uh, but it is how the game is. So... <laughs> you just you just gotta wait to make some money sometimes. I don't think you can take up a loan in this game. Uh, no. I don't think so. Yeah, we're just basically waiting for the end of this year. And then if we go into uh, the negatives again after we have been in the positive now by the end of the year, then we have another two years to fix that. So we can't do it again. It's But I don't think we can actually... Like when you start off the first year, you can go as much in the negative as you want. And in the coming years after that, you can't go in the negative at all. The game just won't let you. But we're good. We're good. October's going to end soon. And uh, yeah, life's going to be good. We need to figure out expansion paths and uh, improvements to current holes. But can certainly be made improvements to this one as well. It isn't terrible. If it has at least a skill rating of 1, then it's okay. And this has a bit more than that. Just really this hole holding us back here. But it, it, it's getting better. Right now it has 0 0.01 skill rating. Meaning this has 1.2 then, so... 
But this, yeah, there's improvements I'm seeing that can be made here, and we will get to them in the next episode, I think. This episode right now is all about just getting to the end of this year and solidifying our position as not broke, basically. There we go. Fun rating increased, skill rating decreased, membership increased. We now have 12 members. And, uh, yeah, I mean, there you have it. I think we're just going to call this episode here. And what I'm going to do, uh, so that the next episode isn't just a lot of waiting for things to happen, I'm just going to leave the game running for a year or two, just so we can get uh, some cash to play around with for the next episode. So when you see me in the next episode, it's probably going to be either 2005 or 2006. And with that being said, well, oh look at this, beautiful. Plus thousand, plus thousand, we're doing pretty good. People are very happy. People are very happy. This is working out so far. But it is impossible difficulty, so at some point it's just going to snap and everything's going to collapse. And uh, I'll explain a little bit why that happens, when it happens. So far, thank you for watching. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, I would appreciate if you would leave a like on my video. Maybe even subscribe, comment, share, blah, 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 all that. All that YouTuber nonsense right there. It does help me out. So, you know, I would appreciate it. But either way, you can catch me in the next one. And I got some more content out there as well for you. So, well, have a good one.